Today is February 24th, 2022. Went and test drove a Dodge Ram uh, 2500 Cummings. Guy had it up for 7,500 bucks. Ended getting them down to 6,600 bucks. Um, that's not including the Salter, but it does have four new tires, new drive shaft. Um, it's kind of in rough condition, but you know what? After reviewing it, it didn't look too bad. But um, I will be going to pick that up in about an hour. I got to go run to the bank, grab some cash. What's up guys? So this is uh, the truck that I picked up today. Or uh, not today, I picked up two days ago. Um, this is the Dodge Cummins uh, 24 valve diesel. Um, I know it's in rough shape, uh, but I'm probably gonna fix it up, make it look pretty good. Um, the bed is absolutely shot on this thing. This is, uh, it was a salt truck. But if you could see, you know, and it's just filled with rust underneath and stuff. But I checked the frame out, it looks good. Um, obviously this is, you know, needs a new bed and uh, new wheel wells and stuff. But besides that, you know, rocker panels and some fender flares maybe, it, uh, it runs good. I'm gonna to try to uh, check to see if it's a 53 block, but from me trying to check two days ago, I couldn't tell uh, because there was no number where the number's supposed to be. I checked uh, the driver's side as well as the, uh, the other side. So I'm gonna do that. I'll show you guys the inside really quick. Um, let's see. This is the interior. Uh, it's a mess right now because I put a bunch of stuff in buddy gave me this i got some stuff i went through the owner's manual uh leather seats uh it's got 76k on the the ticker and um this is the only thing right up here everybody knows those dodges you know they have whatever but um yeah it's not so bad clean up pretty good that's right where it should be That's where it should be, right there. All right, so right now, what I'm doing. First off, my degreaser, the little button came off, so I just poked a hole with a screwdriver, um, and I'm gonna degrease a little bit. But I'm looking right now to see if it's a 53 block. And what people said is that it's right underneath the wiring harness. If you go one bolt, right, on the oil pan, one bolt, two bolt, should be right above the second bolt on the driver's side. Um, this is where it should be, right, I think, right on that flat piece right there. But if you look, if you look up, right, underneath that wire, right, it says 28C, and if there's nine digits total, I think it's a Mexican block, which is good. So we're going to go up. Look, is that those anything? That looks like numbers and shit, doesn't it? Right? I don't really know what those things are. So I moved over. I'm definitely uh, I'm now on passenger side right here. I just want to show you guys the oil filter is right there. Okay. So if I'm right. It should be. Shouldn't it be right there? Oil filter's right above. All right, go up a little bit. There's nothing there. So, I don't really know. 